Yeah, day Tuesday, July 11th, up here at the farm. You see where I've been mowing. That's with my new John Deere Z2250 turn. Brought it up here. This is its new home. And I moved some stuff around underneath the lean to and got my John Deere 2030 and my Ford 335 industrial that's tagged to 3600 under a cover finally. So they're up underneath the lean to. I hate having stuff out in the weather. Backhoe, I got no choice. It won't fit nowhere. But that's the only thing that's still under the weather. Out in the weather. I got some more cleaning up I got to do up here. I was just throwing stuff out the way so I can get my stuff under the lead to. Move back here behind the barn with the Z225. That's why I brought it up here is to mow around the barns uh, up there by the front gate on the entranceway uh, by the travel trailer deck, places like that. Still got to spray herbicide. I'll probably come up day after tomorrow to do that. It's supposed to be hitting 100 degrees towards the end of the week. And the rain should be out of here by tomorrow, hopefully. And, uh, so I'll mix up a batch and spray, spray, spray. But yeah, I got my tractors under the lean to. Feel good about that. Off in the distance, the wife's on the, the uh, Yanmar 2310. Uh, taking it for a joy ride, terrorize the deer. You might see in the opening of the other barn, the John Deere Z2250 turn is inside that barn. So, productive day. Nothing got broke, nothing got lost, nothing fell off. That mower, it mows as good as a new one. Yeah, that's a good one now. And, uh, Zero issues, and I was mowing some tall, tall stuff. Mowed right through it. <laughs> Had to slow down, of course, but now the rest of it I can get with a six foot mower or my toe behind uh, on the major portion up there. So, had a plan. Plan's working out. But, let me lock up my 10 foot trailer and load my ramps back up and be heading toward La Casa. Once wife gets done joyriding on the Anmar, that's all for this one. Thank you.